Today we start our College Football 25 Dynasty Mode journey. After failing to rebuild Rice on College Football revamp, we are going to see if we can lead the worst overall team on College Football 25 to a national championship. It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a long time coming since we started a dynasty team. Who is the worst team on this game? New Mexico. Kind of want to be New Mexico. What I low-key want to be is school that just nobody knows about. You know what I mean? I kind of want to start at Arkansas State. Where is that? UL Monroe. I think this is the team. ULM. We're one letter away from BLM. You know what? We're going with UL Monroe. Ladies and gentlemen, we are starting our first ever CFB 25 dynasty rebuild. You know the last time I did one of these? Um, I didn't finish it. All right, I was rice. I was thinking about doing rice this time as well, but you know what? I feel like we need a new start, and I've just decided that we're gonna do the UL Monroe Warhawks. Probably the worst team on this game. Are they the worst team? Let me see. Is there a one-star team on this game? Hold on. There is South Alabama. Oh my god, I could be South Alabama. Rice is one star? Oh, I could have been rice too. Oh wow, this is this is, this is is disgusting. Yeah, okay. But you know what? No. We're going UL Monroe. UL Monroe Warhawks. Um, we are gonna be the head coach. It's kind of cool. We could be the coordinators. I didn't know that. Uh, who is this guy? Joel Fitzpatrick. Yeah, you're out of here. Yup, you're gone. Ooh, what's our backstory? What is our backstory? Hold on. Motivator. Get your players to play their best by boosting their rating and composure. Nobody has it better than us. This guy sounds like Jim Harbaugh. Okay, recruiter. Yeah, you know what, man? I think I, I think I'm a recruiter. I really am a tactician, though. You know what I mean? Like, I really know my X's and O's well, but I think we gotta be a recruiter, man. We gotta be able to recruit all these. You know what I mean? These two stars three stars to come to you all monroe what is that pose now we could go with hefe your mom you know what i mean we could bring him back but you know what we got a new head coach we're starting a new era this is our first ever cfb 25 dynasty is my camera lagging it's not lagging hopefully it's not lagging but it's my first ever cfb 25 dynasty we got to start up with a new person offensive playbook you know um i love i love a uh, veer and shoot yeah and then you know my defensive principles you know i i, I really used to study the 425 uh alma mater where am i from this is only america right okay this is only america America. Is there an NYU? Can I be from NYU? I'm Chinese. I gotta be from NYU, right? Let's see. New York, New Mexico, New Mexico State. Okay, we just skipped New York. That's awesome. I'm from UL Monroe. University of Louisiana Monroe. I'm coming to Louisiana. I graduated from Louisiana. God, I love gumbo. I love Zion. Adaptive AI. That is, that sounds Asian. I don't know what that is. All right, we're going to skip that. Snap. Oh, snap. Oh, my, oh, I got to show recruits this photo right here. Yeah. I can't show them this one. What the hell is that? Me and the recruits were taking photos in front of this one. You know what I'm saying? Come to ULM. You know what I'm saying? Come to ULM. If you're BLM, come to ULM. If you don't come to ULM, you're not BLM. All right, offensive ag aggressiveness. I like it at 50. Three? Uh, appearance. Yep, that's not Piao Piao. Where's the Chinese guy? There's no Chinese guy? Ah, oh, man, no. All right, we got a 5'5", five, five, 400 pounder here. His head needs to change, though. He kind of looks lesbian right now, man. I don't like it. Come on, man. Where's the Chinese guy? All right, you know what? I give up. We're just gonna make him Indian. Sure, why's Indian? Half Indian, half Chinese. Oh my God, this team sucks. Five and six, five and six, four and eight, six and six, four and eight. What the, what, what am I, what the, what? Oh my God, I went to university during this time. Oh and 10 in 2020. Wow, this team sucks. This is the worst team in the game what's our goal four games are you in your mind okay all right but you know what we've signed our name on the paper we've completed our contractual talks xue hua piao piao is in the building general booty is our quarterback okay what's going on hold on is this is this a real player general booty oh my god he's actual he's an actual player he's the nephew of former nfl quarterback john david booty okay you know what i like this guy he's got football in his veins Let's take a look at his 247 general booty he was a three star Okay, wait, hold on. This guy might be a baller. And we have a red shirt freshman, Reese Mooney. Running back, Hunter Smith. 88 speed, 95 excel. How tall is this guy? 5'11". All right, so he's a little, a little back. He's a junior as well, so he's on the same timeline as Booty. We have a red shirt sophomore here, Bennett Galloway, a white running back from Chapin, South Carolina. 92 speed, 92 excel. So he's probably the running back of the future. He might even be the running back right now. Brother has 85 trucking at 5'11". Now, you can't catch, you know, chlamydia. All right, let's take a look at the wideouts. Yeah, this is an issue. We have a 6'5 deep threat. Tyler Griffin, the junior right here, 75 overall. It's our best player. And then we have a senior 70-year-old. 70 70 I was about to say 70-year-old. Senior 70 overall, Mark Britt. Errol City, this guy sucks. These guys are terrible, man. Oh, my God. We don't have anything on wide receiver. We need to recruit wideouts. Tight ends. 
What the hell is this, man? Darius Bailey. Is this guy Indian? Do we have an Indian tight end? Quad Harrison. What am I looking at right here? We need a tight end. This is actually embarrassing. My left tackle is a right tackle. Our only actual left tackle is a 62. 84 left guard. Hold on. Wait a minute. This guy might go to the league. Okay. Elijah Fisher. The best player is a redshirt junior left guard. Okay. Elijah Fisher. I can see you playing for the Colts. All right. So we have a left guard. Sort of a center. Jay Mickle. The Mickey James. Right guard. 60. 68, uh, right tackle, 72. Okay, so we really just have left guard center. Defense, do we have a pass rusher? Kevonte Wells, 75. He's just not good enough. We can't win a national championship with this pass rush, man. I think we gotta start here. I think we gotta start down in the trenches. Jaden Hamlin, okay, this is our best D lineman. He looks like he eats 315 pounds. He's got duress. He's under duress. He causes duress. I like it. Linebackers, any linebackers? All right, this is our leader of our defense. Carl Glass Jr. It's a 77 overall middle linebacker right here. All right, he's a senior. Brother probably runs the locker room. Do we have any DBs? Biggers? Oh, wow. 277 overalls. One of them's a senior, other one's a junior. So they're leaving after this year, maybe. Safety, 70 overall. Strong safety, 57 overall. We have a kicker, at least. We don't even have a kicker. All right, so we pretty much have a blank canvas here, ladies and gentlemen. Pretty much have to rebuild this entire team, other than a left guard. All right, what about my coaching staff? Let me take a look at what we got here. Nick Tanner. He's a scheme guru. Guru. He gives us XP bonus for wins versus rank opponents. He's a, uh, what is he? He's a scheme guru. Yeah, I just said that. So this guy's more focused on game planning. I kind of like that. He's got firm handshake, so he's got extra XP for signing a, a recruit as well. Okay, I, you know what? I don't mind this guy. Uh, he's a D, prestige. Oh my god. I think defense coordinator is even worse. D might. He's got firm handshakes too, though. Donovan Harper, Nick Tanner with Xuehua Kao Kao. I like the coaching staff. Okay, so let's go to recruiting right here. We need to out recruit everybody, okay? Everyone that's coming through Louisiana, they can't fall through the cracks. Okay, so the game's telling me I need a running back, wide receiver, left tackle, right guard, right tackle. No, we need everything. What about the defensive end? All right, so it says I don't need some of these positions. I don't know what this game is smoking. I think we need all the help we can get. Cordell Bryant, we are seventh on this guy's list. Okay, yeah, definitely target him. Texas guys want to play for Piao Piao. Okay, all right, I like this. There's also some three stars here. Rodney Hodges, he's from Louisiana. All right, add him to the list. Greg McCartney, cornerback. All right, you know what? I'm just going to add everybody who, who, who wants me that's like three star or hired on this list. Jeremy McDuffie, another middle linebacker there. We're going to add him. A lot of one stars that want to come here. You know, I'm trying to get the highest ranked recruits to ULM. I'm not trying to have no bums here. Okay, so this is what we need to improve so that we could get more like players, more recruit better players. We're currently the 97th best school in America. That's not good. Championship contender is a D plus. Program tradition is a D. This is all not good. The really only thing we have going for us, in my opinion, is proximity to home. So I think we just start out recruiting Louisiana, like gumbo eating Zions, and then we move from there because I, I don't see any other reason why someone would come to ULM other than the fact they want to stay home in Louisiana. So we're just going to go my pipelines and recruit from here. All right, let's shoot for the stars. Juan Renes, five star cornerback. You know what? Add him to the list. I can't recruit any of these guys because our deal breakers aren't good enough. Kyle Hodges, he wants to be home. <laughs> come to ULM. They're still open. You know what I mean? If we could just get like one or two of these guys, that would be insane. That would be an absolute recruiting masterclass from Xue Hua Piao Piao displayed. I, I don't know what else to say. We need to get on these guys early. You know what I'm saying? We got to start visiting their high schools early. We got we to gotta build a relationship with these guys early. Or like Kirby Smart and like Lincoln Riley go over there to suck them off because th th we, we, need, we, th we need this advantage. Desmond DeVoe here. Oh, oh. What, what the hell just happened there? Okay, I don't think that's a good thing. You know what? We're just gonna leave him alone. What the guys that are interested in me? I, I want to take a look at these guys. Rodney Hodges. Now this guy has us fourth on his list. Oh, and he's a gem. Okay, Rodney. Free safety. He likes to support the run. This could be our guy. You know what? Send him a scholarship. Rodney, I want you on the team. I can DM the player. Oh my god, I can't wait to DM a player. Can I, can I DM woman? A white slot corner. Hold on, let's scout him. He's gotta be a bust. He has to be a bust. He has to be a bust. Oh my god, he's actually good. 88 speed. 68 man coverage. You know what? That's better than what we got. Let's give you a scholarship. Welcome, Greg. Join the squad. Darren Sedar. He's an ATH. What the hell is that? Run stopper. All right. I'm going to assume he's a linebacker or a D lineman. Let's scout him. 
He's a gem. Send him a scholarship. So we've offered two middle linebackers. We've offered a lot of defensive players. These are all defensive players. We get an offensive guy in here. Darren Stye. He's a tight end. We, we need a tight end. Oh, he's a gem. Send him a scholarship right there. Yeah, that would be great if we can get him. Vertical threat out of Texas. 6'5 tight end. Yeah, that would be amazing. Go for another corner right here. Elias Torres. Oh my God, it's another gem. Jesus, I'm good. I'm so good at this. Send him a scholarship. All right, here we go. We have Darnell Tobin right here. We're 10th on his list he is a gem a four-star gem he's a pass coverage guy you know what just offer him. we've offered a lot of middle linebackers but if i could just get one or two of them i would be very happy i do need some wide receivers alec russo that's our first scholarship offered to a quarterback all right we'll do that for now we've offered 14 scholarships so far all right on our first day of the job a lot of defensive players oh my god cordell bryant we are number one on his list we're ahead of florida state we're at lsu we're at alabama i brought fried rice to his house i sat in with his family you know what i'm saying i used our washroom and i pissed sitting down so i would avoid having the piss bounce off rebound down into you know piss stains all over the floors i i did that out of respect for cordell let's go man we're number one on his list we're number one on rodney hodge's list i'm a genius oh i'm a recruiting masterclass darren cedar i don't even know what position you play i like you though oh we are number one on a lot of oh my god these guys wait they want me okay week one it's pial pial's debut we're playing fcs southeast i have no idea what that is i've done a lot more recruiting i'm not gonna lie I don't really know what I'm doing, but all I'm going to say is I visited some houses. I've DM some players on Instagram. All right, let's go. Let's get into this game. Home debut. They're technically worse than us. Here we go. ULM is in the building. Oh my God. We have fans. Let's go, Louisiana. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. we run out the tunnel. Yeah. Where's Pia Pia? Boo! 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 We're up 7-0 early here. Can we win in our day? Oh my God, we're up 14-0. We're up 14-10 at halftime. This could be a home debut win. Oh, we're losing. We are down by six in the fourth quarter. Oh my God, General Booty scores a touchdown. He's an absolute gamer. We are up by one now. Oh, we scored another touchdown. We're up by eight. We gotta watch this. Stadium pulse is terrible. Okay, no fans. It's okay. We'll work on that. Oh, the whole first play we get a big ass. Who is that? Five. Who's five? What is his name? Oh, you're, you're terrible. Oh, look at that cheerleader. Yes. Oh, look at this happy family. It's a gay family. Let's go. Who was that? Billy Pullen Jr. I coach up Billy in preseason. I love Billy's game. General Booty. Hey, everybody calm down. Everybody calm down. ULM debut. Home debut. Shui Hua Piao Piao debut. Hand off. I like it. Nine yard gain. Let's get it started. Come on. Come on, Booty. Keep handing the ball off. Keep handing the ball off. Let's go. Let's go. First down. Yes, sir. This is what I'm talking about. Two minute warning to clinch the game right here. Oh my God. He's wide open. Come on. Look for him, Booty. Look for him. Okay, we hand it off. All right, okay, yeah, so we got, we still gotta work on some things. FCS Southeast are loading the box. They got six in the box, block. Okay, yeah, we need to work on the old line. Our kicker is terrible too. We probably can't kick it from here. We probably punt from here. This is not good. Hand off, hand off, go, go, okay. All right, we burned our timeouts, we need to stop. Wait, we're kicking this? How far is this? Hold on, wait, hold on. Are we sure he can make this? Wait a second, I don't think he can make this. Did he make it? He missed, he missed. Oh, now we need to get a stop. We need to stop everybody on their feet. Come on, come on. I'm on my feet, get him! Go! Oh, 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 oh. Come on, let's make some noise, man. What is this stadium pulse? Let's make some noise. Oh, they picked the half, get him. Oh, the pass rush. Oh, give me that! Oh. Come on, I don't even know what it is, but it's a seatbelt. What I do, guys, is I coach defense. You know, I'm, I'm really a defensive-minded guy. Even though I look like the Indian Andy Reid, I'm really a defensive-minded guy. Oh my God, big three formation for Bodie. And we win our first home game, our first game in charge. Look at that, we're praying to the gods. Oh, I can't believe it. You all have baby 1-0 on the year. As we take down FCS Southeast, General booty player of the game. Make him jiggle. Yeah. 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 So bad we are. Oh my God. We level up too. Yes, sir. That is what I'm talking about. Advance the week right here. Shui Hua. Talk to me. 
Darren reaches top eight schools. Am I in his top eight? Oh my God, I'm number one on Darren's list. Lieber, I'm number two. Okay, I think I sent some family to this guy's house. All right, we need this guy. He's our only QB. All right, we're in week two. I don't really know how the scouting works on this game. I, I lose out on these guys, so I'm just gonna remove that five star there. This guy just wants to suck off Notre Dame. This guy wants to go to Miami, He's trying to go see Duke Dennis, He's trying to go get woman. L Vickerson, we are third on the list for L Vickerson. Hold on. Okay, yeah. Okay, so I set the house to this guy that's right we sent the whole staff we sent them some gumbo you know what i mean brandon ingram went over you feel what i'm saying we, we sent the guys from new orleans drew Brees too can i do something else now you know what Let, let's contact friends and family oh my god I, I, that's somebody i need on this team we're third on his list we're competing against tcu and texas tech okay so we're really the only school that's out of the state of texas that's really in the running here the more games we win the more interested these guys will be now darnell tobin we're second you know what let, let, let me dm him real quick you know what i mean let me slide in the dms let me get to know you you know, you're Ronnie Hodges. Let's contact the family. Let's see how your mom is doing. Greg McCartney. All right, slot corner right. This is the this is the white corner with 68 man coverage. Jesus Christ, 66 zone. Do I even want this guy? I'll just scroll his Instagram, I guess. Kind of like stalking him in a way. I also found this Asian guy, Mafu Chen. I already sent friends and family. You know, we're, we're already we're family friends. This really shouldn't have cost me 25 hours. Like his mom is friends with my mom. You know what I mean? They have each other on Apple contacts. All right, we also have some coaching points here. You know, what? I'm just gonna get better at recruiting. I think we this is the only way we can get better is by convincing people that this program is to die for. Uh, we definitely need a quarterback. So you know what? I'm just going to use all my points there on passing game. And I also need some blocking too. So we're going to take advanced look at blocking. There you go. Can we win two games in a row? Oh my God. Look at the fans. The more riled up this game. I like what I'm seeing. We're kind of building a culture here within Louisiana. I feel like what we're doing right here is really authentic. You know, I'm not making a Southern accent. You know what I mean? I'm not doing anything fake. I'm, I'm, I'm just being myself. I'm including fried rice with the gumbo you know what i'm saying look yeah let's hype him up all right okay all right we got blown out at home by uab on amari thomas just destroys our secondary there th th this is ulm football yeah that was a reality check i i have no clue how he won that first game cordell bryant we're number one in his school influence we're ahead of schools like florida state lsu just gonna let my recruiters do their thing there darnell tobin another four-star middle linebacker we are first on his list as well and now we are first on greg mccartney's list we were second earlier but then you know what i'm saying I, I did the social media check so we're getting a lot of defensive help we are first on the michael wilkerson's list that's what happens when you send drew Brees and brandon ingram over oh my god brian lieber we're first on his list till we're sending the house chen oh my god see you see my mom called what happens when my mom calls you know what i'm saying mafu chen could be our new starting center friends and family you know what i mean come on man you gotta join pal pal my boy come on man we're, we're family friends you know what i'm saying ronnie hodges we're second on his list we do need a free safety Ugh, is there anything i can do for you ronnie Oh, I've only sent the friends and family. Rodney, my bad. Let me let me send Zyra Williamson. Can I do that? Wait, I can't do that? Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. I can't do that. I don't think we're doing a bad job recruiting, though. Oh, we're fourth on this guy's list. Four-star wide receiver. You know what? The recruiting is kind of paying off here. We get two three-star centers here. One of them's a gem. One of them's Chinese. At our first, we have our QB here, Brian Lieber from Houston, Texas. And we're over University of Houston in the recruiting. I, I, I think I'm just like, I must be given head. I don't know what people how was doing but, but we're recruiting man oh god week four we played texas at texas as well uh this is this is not gonna go well oh my god look at the overall differences oh oh god oh they're bringing the bowl out against ulm are you serious is this a night game is this nationally televised what's going on oh my god that's literally matthew mcconaughey's cousin what what is happening right now why are we doing all this for a game against ulm is this what they do every game let me just watch the first drive i just want to see the first drive before we super Sam, I just want to see our defense play. First play. Oh, 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 we forced a bubble. I thought they gained nine yards. Oh my god. We have cheerleaders at the game. I can't believe we had the budget to send cheerleaders on the game. We just want the bubble. Carlin Biggers. My goodness, the senior stepping up. He's a punching. See, that's the technique that we teach in practice. Just let me watch one drive. Yeah, general booty. Yeah. Yeah, everybody settle down. We're in the SEC. We're in the SEC. Okay, first play. Lose the yard. Second play. Come on. We'll take a field goal. All right, we'll take a field goal. Come on, general. Come on, general. Oh my god, RPO. Oh. Oh, okay. All right. Why didn't you throw that? We've got negative one, negative one on our first two plays. Third and 12. Oh! 
Oh, general booty. Oh, and we're punting. All right, just keep it close. Just keep it close, boys. Just keep it close. Okay, they put up seven. Okay, they put up 14. All right. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. 45 to 10. We lose to Texas. Quinn Ewers might be a Heisman Trophy winner. Isaiah Bond, three touchdowns, zero catches. I don't even know how you do that. But you know what? I saw a forced fumble. I, I see potential in this team. There is some light at the end of the tunnel. You know what I mean? We level up. Oh my God. We have our first recruit. We have our first committed recruit. First one of CFB 25, Ryan Lieber, quarterback out of Houston, Texas, is committed. And this is good because General Booty, he was threatening to leave the school. Yeah, his risk of transfer is like pretty hot. So it's good that we have a quarterback coming in next year for sure. Verbally committed. I love the sight of that. We're losing out on Moncrief though. Kansas is stepping up. Boy, Kansas is going to take someone out of New Orleans, man. Okay, Rodney Hodges has reached his top three schools. We're in the top three. We're competing against Memphis. We can't let a Louisiana guy go to Memphis. I can't let that happen. Quentin Moncrief, also one of those guys. We can't let him go to Kansas. Four-star wide receiver. This guy, would, this guy would change the trajectory of the team. So you know what? I'm gonna hard sell him here. Oh, or should I schedule a visit? Should I go see him? Five, seven wide receiver. He's a route runner. This guy's gonna be a slot machine. You know what? We're gonna schedule a visit. Come see us. Oh, we're gonna lose that game. Oh, we're gonna lose that game too. Ah, oh, should we do that? No, you know what? Let's just hard sell him. We're gonna sell him on being a hometown hero. You know, he's from Louisiana. He's from New Orleans. Oh my goodness. We let someone from Louisiana slip to Memphis. Rodney Hodges. Hurts. I spent a lot of hours on Rodney Hodges. Ah, you can't get them all though. Well, Michael Vickerson, we are in his top three. We already sent the house towards him, so we can't really do anything there. Here are the top 25 rankings for this year. Um, yeah, we're not here, but this is where I want to get to one day right here, man. Michigan is the number one school in the nation. Ohio State right behind them with Penn State and Oregon rounding out the top four. We we are currently two and five. We're pretty much halfway through the year right now. Just doing a lot of recruiting. Oh my God, Kansas is gonna take my two receivers. Kansas is gonna take them away. We're just, we're not winning games. So none of these people wanna come to our school. We're two and six. Our team is not good enough, but we can't, I can't do anything about that. Like this, my team is my team. Nickerson is gone. He committed to TCU. Quinton Moncrief. I did a hard sell. I offered a scholarship. I, I'm not sure he's gonna come here. So we gotta focus on Sierra. All right, you know what? Let's schedule a visit. Come watch a game. All right, week 14. Come see us play the 6 and 2 Raging Cajuns. I'm sure that'll sell him on coming to ULM. Yep. Um, attend a lecture? No, we won't let him do that. Um, let's, um, let's, 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 let's let him do a uh, family visit. Then we'll do a soft sell. You can be a hometown hero here, Jalen Sierra. And we get our second commitment Cedric Dora, the center out of Houston, Texas. He is committed. He's a gem as well. So he might be able to help. We are two and seven. My God. But Moncrief has committed to Kansas. We let another Louisiana player go to Kansas. Okay, all of our focus has to go on that last four-star wide receiver, Jalen Sierra. Oh, he wants to go. Oh, he wants to go to Kansas too. I, I swear to God. Darnell Tobin has gone to SMU. I just scheduled a visit with him, man. We also lose out on Greg McCartney, a slot corner, whatever. Week 14 here. Yeah, we're just losing out on recruits now. This guy's gone. This guy joins Oregon State. This guy goes to Iowa. This is this is terrible. Probably gonna lose out on some more Jalen Sierra, that last four-star wide receiver. Yeah, he's on a visit this week. We're currently third in the ranks. We, we gotta win this week to really sell him into coming here, man. And this is our rivalry game. These are our rivals. The two Louisiana teams here, Raging Cajuns versus ULM. Four-star wide receivers in the stands too. He attended practice. Here we go, boys. Can we just can we just pull one out of our ass? Can we please just get a win here? Two and nine versus eight and three. Can we sway a four-star receiver to come to ULM? Here we go. First quarter. We're down seven. We're down 14. Come on, just keep it close, boys. Keep it close, man. Get on the board. Oh my goodness. Oh, brother. We have th oh, we have 10 points at halftime. We're down by 21. Oh my god. We give up 52 points in a rival game against Louisiana. We lose 52 to 23. Yeah, where we lost the four-star receiver. This is actually the worst school in the nation. Why, why did I pick ULM? But we get our third recruit, our first Chinese player on the team. Out of Mechanicsville, Virginia, Mafu Chen, also known as Chen Mafu. You know what I'm saying? Oh, 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 and we get another recruit. Out of Dallas, Texas, George Toledo. We get a strong safety there. We needed some help in the secondary. Jalen Sierra, 
Bear up. Yep, he's gone to TCU. Yeah, he he didn't like what he saw there. Still got some chances at some players. Okay, Chris Dwayne. Yep, we're we're way ahead on him. My goodness. All right, if he doesn't sign here, then there is something majorly wrong with our school. Cordell Bryant, we've lost out on him. LSU jumps us. This is supposed to be our middle linebacker. This is supposed to be the leader of the defense. I thought we had him. Oh my god, LSU and the Raging Cajuns. They're getting our Louisiana guys. Oh, but we get our first wide receiver commit. Steven Boyd, a wide receiver out of Richmond, Texas. We'll take that. There's our first threat, deep threat, a 5'9 guy out of Texas. Jalen Milrow wins the Heisman Trophy in the first season here. We got job offers? Oh, oh my God. Ball State, Marshall, New Mexico State, Kennesaw State. No, no, you know what? It doesn't make any sense for me to leave. I'm not leaving ULM until we win a national championship. So yeah, we conclude our first season. We won our first game. I thought we would go crazy. And then we just, we just, we did not do well the rest of the year. We won a game against James Madison, but we lose the rest of the year, man. We end the game on a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven game of losing streets. We lost out on so many recruits over that stretch. It is not a good look at all. And this is the first year college football playoff bracket. The top four is Michigan, Georgia, NC State, and Utah. General Booty, 76 overall quarterback. Ends his junior year, 2,938 yards, 22 touchdowns, 15 interceptions. Just nothing special. He took a lot of sacks though. He had a really, really bad offensive line. I feel like we didn't give him a chance. He's a junior, so he might return for next year. He might be our QB in year two as well. He did not run the ball well at all. Hunter Smith junior as well i feel like that has something to do with maybe our offensive style though you know what i'm saying you know i'm trying to uh, you know replicate the andy reed style you know what i mean being 400 pounds and everything wide receivers though we definitely need help here this this is just this is just not good look at all these drops too a lot of drops going across the board blocking yeah uh this this needs to get fixed up we'll, we'll have some blocking help next year we'll have a new center replacing jay nickel who's gonna graduate gave him six sacks jesus christ and yeah defense isn't generating enough turnovers you know what i mean seven fumble recoveries in 12 games I, I just yeah it's not good enough not a great season for the first year at ULM and Georgia wins the national championship in year one 34 31 final score ULM will be here one day I promise you sure Piao Piao Pia will lead them there well, we conclude the first year with a commitment from a tight end we needed help at the tight end position there Chris Swain has committed over Texas and over Ohio State General Booty is going to transfer out of ULM after year one. Same with JD Stewart. Carlin Biggers, our best corner, is gonna go. He's graduating. Congratulations. Jalen Ware, best D tackle, and our center, Jay Nickel, are all gonna be graduating. These are like four of our best players. I mean, look at the overall. That those are highest overalls. And we have the transfer portal. Oh my god. You know what? I'm gonna end the first episode there. Next time we will be doing season two. Let me know what you guys think about these full season episodes. I'm trying to make them longer. I want your input on transfer portal what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong. You know what I'm saying? It's my first Dynasty mode in College Bowl 25. I want to hear what you guys think, man. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys for season two of the ULM Rebuild.